everyone and welcome back to the last episode of Let's Play Tomb Raider. So we start the game with... Sorry, we start the level with the boss fight. Like all the other mutants that we defeated, the single explodes, but as you could see, we even we didn't even take a single bit of damage. I'm going to pick up all the UZ clips that are around this level. Sorry, yeah, this area. So, let's go through the creepy corridor. I didn't mean to bump my head over there, but oh well. We don't have to worry about those jumping blades just now. this block as well. And by the way, I'm not the only one that thinks that these blocks look like a spine, right? Don't bump your head. I think that they simply put these chopping blades here because, because these are the only ones that are in this level. And we are done. You won't see any of those again, although we'll be hearing it two more times. After pushing that block, we can go all the way here. We're going to pull this block two times. Sorry about that, don't know what happened. And you you do that. To we'll open this door into next 
straps of the area. Now I need to do a standing jump here. I cut it close, but all well, all well when it ends well. Now I want to do running jump, and if you reach here, you'll see that a bridge is now laid in on that spot. So I'm going to use it. reach the very first secret of this of the last map and get some more health and some more ammo now I want to pull this lever twice what? Okay, I, that was definitely a bug, I don't know what happened there. Lara simply got on fire, I don't know why. Oh really? Oh. Yeah, I never saw that one. I wonder what happened. <laughs> well, at least I got to show a bug of the game. Oh, well, let's simply pull the switch once again. open the door there we go now to do the standing jumps got scared two times already here the bridge will lower Now the sound won't uh, play because I already pick up the the secret. So since we already have it, it won't happen again. Now I do this more slowly and see if that was the problem. Okay, I, I know that this is going to happen, but I don't know why I caught I caught on fire. Oh. I thought it would be too much. I knew that the bridge was meant to to lower, but I don't know why that happened the way it did. So, oh well. By the way, those little sparks of where am I? Oh, I know where I am. Those little sparks of fire will do damage to you. Now we'll be having a set of boulders that will go down on us. Simply need to activate them and then 
take over. Is there still more, more boulders? Okay, no. Oops. I did meant to grab, but oh well. Destroyed Sion, and by doing that, the level will start shaking all the way to the end. Unfortunately, can you please come here? Thank you. There's one on the left as well, and the last one is hiding over here. I don't think I need to deal with this one. What that is was pretty much taking damage. Now I want to go over here and fall down to the platform. You can see that we have a place that we can grab. And now we're going to shimmy all the way to the right. Don't worry about the arrows, they don't deal that much of a damage, so... Well, of course, if you need, simply heal, but... Luckily, Tomb Raider 1 is very generous with the health pack, so... Can we do a junk pack? Now I want to actually go all the way near the edge because if you go over here. What? Okay. I didn't trigger it. I don't know why that happened. Okay, this play this last level is getting a tiny bit on the nerves, but oh well. And no, since I show you how to defeat the three guys, I'm not going to do it again. They are more of a bother than a necessity. Now let's hope that we don't hear him through the end of the level. Simply jump back. Now, before I got out here, Oh, I guess I had the trigger wrong. I thought that this tile was the trigger, but I guess it were all the three on the bottom. Now, I want to jump to the part where there is no spikes. Oh, with my health. Okay, good enough. go around spikes here you want to set up to do a standing jump then a running jump I'm going to go one step back and do a standing jump and into a running jump that way we can get there no problem and now that you see this red wall if you jump over there Lara can grab and we can shimmy all the way to the right. This takes some time, but oh, at least Lara is not get his hands on fire. Because I am seeing a tiny bit of lava there, but oh well.
So a little further more and we're almost there. And if you reach here, you get secret number two. You get some some health, some more ammo and lastly some more health. By the way, how is my health? I'm going to top it off. Now, you want to fall here, but what you want to do is press the action button, go back, release, and Lara will get into this pl platform without any problem. Can you save please, Lara? Thank you. Now, you want to do a standing jump over here. Now, you want to go to the room where the tanker is, but you, you cannot take our time because that boulder will fall, so you have to time it properly. And I didn't, so... Now here, forget the medipack, just let the boulder roll, and then do, do a jump while pressing action. And Lara will be able to pass on top of the boulder. So here we go. There's that. Now we have to go to this ramp and jump at the end. Nice and easy. Now here in this room you simply simply go until you reach the small medipack because lava will get you and then start jumping again and you can reach this place no problem. Now first of all, let's go to the grab some sorry some music clips. Oh I'm keeping my health on top because Simply can. Now you want to go all the way to the end. That way the boulder will not hit you. And do a standing jump. Grab. The boulder will pass right on top of you. In this room, you want to go to the corner. And do a series of standing jumps. So. Don't worry about the fire because you will not get burned, but as long as you stay in the straight path. And here, you want to go to the very end, so you need to do two jumps in a row. For do that, you want to do one step back, one jump back and one step back. And that way Lara will get here. And this is the secret number three. Uh, unfortunately, I believe it's bugged in, and it won't appear in the, in the end screen, but we got it nonetheless. And to continue our way, simply do a swan dime jump off the edge. We'll get into the water. Let's pick up the use clips. Going to save my progress one last time. And get your weapons ready because we are fighting. Where was he? Come on. Okay, this is my biggest problem is finding her. Uh, 
not really concerned about how much damage she will deal to me because the 44 health packs. She's, she's down. You want to stay there for a while? I think I'm going to the wrong place. Yes, I am. Well, time time I take him, she'll probably get up sooner or later. But you can't go. bump off me and my brood so easy, Lara. She's old. I was going to show you something, but I got lost. Well, I'm going to simply take the damage because Natla is not really that strong like this. She'll fall before I do. If you want, you can simply jump around. What I wanted to show is that you can pick up these UZ clips. But with that done, there's one more thing that we need to do, and is escape this place. Hmm, I think I actually am pretty good. Simply jump here. Jump once again. Now to reach the end, we simply need to do a bunch of platforming so as long as I don't mess my jumps we should be okay there are more, no more enemies there are only five in the entire level so and those are the two bosses plus the three mutants that we that we fight before destroying the Scion. I never know if I need to grab or not, so... So let's go, we're almost there. This is the last jump of the game. As long as I'm able to pull this one off, we are on free. And we are done. There's nothing else we can do. Slaro will simply go on our merry way. There we have it. I have more kills than I should because, well, I actually don't know why I, sh I have that many, but oh well. If you were able to see, we got only two out of three secrets, but that was because the last one was bugged, so there's that.
luckily for our Lara, she took care of all the goons, so she had the ship waiting for her. And that's the end of the game. Here we have the creators. I want to say that I have I had a blast playing the game, although I'm not I'm not the most killed Tomb Raider player, but at least it was my honest playthrough. I didn't try to get everything perfect. So So I want to thank everyone to I want to thank everyone for watching this video. And if you watch the, the LP as well, if you stay long enough in the menu screen, you'll get into demo version. That's what happened. And with that in mind, I want to thank everyone who watched, and I hope to see you on my next Let's Play. Bye!